Help you out. Sure. Yes, sir. Good afternoon. Right, and so I don't know that that's my role to tell the investigators how to investigate the case. I want to be more of a support to them. If you have, a, if we have a resource in my office that you can use, I want to make that available to them. Having said that, I think investigators constantly relook at evidence every day. Is there something I miss? Is there something else I can I can do? So I, I think that's constantly going on. But in my opinion, it's not my place to give direction to the investigators on how to run the investigation. Um, I just want to be a support for them uh, with anything that I can do through my office. I can repeat the question, I apologize. Well, the reward is still there. Uh, to my knowledge, I, I don't know the exact amount, but I think it's around 225000 So the reward is still there. Um, so I, I think that is still there available. That I can't comment on. No. Well, Rich, no, I, I, I did not. And, and how this has affected me pales in comparison to how it's affected the family members, this community, and, and these incredible investigators that committed, literally committed their lives to this. I really appreciate the question, but we can't lose sight of that. Um, but on the other side, of the, on the other side I'm, I'm inspired by what I see. And I had somebody recently ask me about the word hope. And there, I have, I have tremendous hope, tremendous hope. Um, seeing what's happened is just, it's been an extraordinary journey for me. And um, most importantly though, while we're standing up here today, I think all of us would probably agree, the people that matter are flanking us. We just get to represent them. So I, Rich, I appreciate the question. Well, um, first of all, we're not going to comment on what we're evaluating and analyzing, but there's always an analogy to some other situation, which is good. And we can, we can turn that into a very positive, and I appreciate that. We can turn it into a positive because every time that happens, it causes these extraordinary folks that are, that are doing this work to reset. That was asked a little bit ago, and not necessarily a reset of the entire thing, but it causes them to take a step back and think, okay, maybe there's something connected to that two, three, and four steps away, maybe. So as technology continues to evolve, we certainly hope one day that, that we can show our complete hand to this, but today is not the day to do that. Very personally, I take a walk on the trail. Functionally and professionally, um, I, I, I'm confident it's not going to take that long. I think there are a lot of things happening in regards to the way in which we communicate, social media platforms, um, as human beings, in all that we do each and every each and every day. Somebody knows who this murderer is. Somebody knows. So I really believe, I really believe that it's not going to be 
another April Tinsley, Tinsley case. I can't imagine what her family endured for nearly 30 years. And I don't believe it's gonna be that way here in Delphi, Indiana. Well, I, I can tell you that Chief Mullins, Sheriff Linsenby, the FBI, all the way up to the, 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 the Grant Manion Hall here in, in Indiana, we communicate all the time. But again, what we communicate is what we hear from those folks that are doing this important work. So um, that rhythm is going to stay strong. It's going to stay strong. What I've heard multiple times over the course of this, when we think we're done, we're going to start all over again. Because the FBI is brought to Delphi, Indiana, have been extraordinary and the technology and the pieces and parts to maintain a, a huge, huge case that, that we've had for now two years. So um, we'll stay diligent and we'll maintain that. What was the second part of your question, Rich? generally speak, not helpful, and it hampers the investigation. With the, the way in which Nick is involved here in this county, the way in which the families of Abby and Libby are involved in this county, that is not helpful. It is not helpful. And as he said, forward us information, but don't do the analogy on your own. Please. Thank you. Well, I guess uh, I'm confident we're going to solve this case. So I'm confident that if he's listening in or she's listening in or whoever it is, that at some point I will be sitting across from you in the courtroom. And so about all I can say about it, but I'm confident we're going to resolve this case. I'm confident we're going to get an arrest and I'm confident we're going to solve it. So, I, I'm sorry. I've got to take a stab at that. Um, it's the first thing that, that my simple brain thinks of in the morning. It's the last thing I think of at night, and I know I represent everybody else that's dressed like me today. If you're watching, we're coming. If you're watching, we are coming. This county of Carroll and all that has happened here and all of the sadness associated with this county is unacceptable in a civilized society. But the, other, the flip side of that is, look what's happened in this community because of these tragic events. I mean, the, 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 the unity and unification and what's actually coming of this and the positivity associated with human interaction is really something to watch. But if you're watching, as Nick said, I, I, hope, I hope that I uh, am able to stare him in the eye and ask him why. Because at the end of the day, the, the two behind me are the ones that matter the most, then the family, then this community. At this point, we don't comment on, on any, anything about the investigation. We're here to, to, to focus on uh, Abby and Libby and focus on that look this is not a closed case and, and again if someone has a tip for something call it in let us investigate it and again this is what makes a good tip the, the poster here behind Sergeant Riley if you don't have all information it's okay still call in the tip but I don't want to touch base or I don't want to talk about the, speci the specific aspects of the investigation at this time the main reason is for the integrity of the case Right. At some point, this case is going to go to trial or, or come to the courts, and we need to make sure that the case, the integrity of the case is solid. Uh, and so that's the main reason.
Well, unfortunately, and the fear sound like a broken record, it kind of falls in the same category. And so I'm not going to comment on that at this time. Uh, again, I, I, I want to focus on kind of the things that I talked about today and just let everybody know that the dedication to solve this thing is here. It's not only here in my office, but here behind me and everyone supporting this investigation. And so I, I don't want to comment on that. I want to focus on, uh, you know, the fact that we've gotten tips, we keep getting tips, uh, and we hope to continue to get them until we get this thing solved. So. Apologize, but no, we won't discuss anything regarding this active investigation. But we do provide any and all resources we have to support and advance this investigation. Any resource that we are capable of, whether it be technological or investigative, we are applying it and we do it every day. That's all I can tell you. I'm sorry. We want to thank you all for being here. We appreciate your time. Have a safe trip home.